Gracias. take you with me on a project, on a new pro project, so I started to feed uh, small birds in an area that I have been feeding some small birds before, so uh, I thought that might be a good chance to like taking you along the, the type of project and show you the process along. I see the feeding station now. I can see there are some birds, but I have no idea. But uh, the main reason why I started to feed here is I have seen goldfinches earlier. And uh, that is the hope, the hope, the hope that uh, the goldfinches will come. I do not have any pictures of the goldfinch, and that's a really beautiful bird. So, yeah. See some blue jets, so uh, there are some activity. So let's get ready. I will have bring my uh, new dragon hide with me. It's raining, so that's good. So I need to go and position myself, and then uh, I will talk to you. Here, I just wanted to quickly set this tent up so I won't, didn't want to disturb too much and therefore I didn't film anything of that but yeah like I said it's gonna be a moral of a test project that I'm going to take you with me so I'm not expecting any good pictures today uh, I will show you a couple of pictures I made on this area uh, a couple of years ago not in the winter time but in uh, in the spring summer time uh, so yeah it has a good potential here the great thing about this area is it has uh, a mix of open area and mixed type of wood like pine trees and and uh, yeah I don't know what it's called don't what don't know what it's called the other one but the other trees would leave uh, but yeah that makes it really good for many types of species but the main goal that I'm really hoping for is the goldfinch I have seen it here in the summertime and I think it nests in this area in the spring summer so if I'm lucky I'm going to get a goldfinch I don't think it's gonna be out now and but yeah I'm gonna keep uh, doing this project and I will of course make a video like a little series of this type of project <clears throat> and maybe you get something out of it to do something of this yourself just had the first blue tip but it went straight to the to the feeder I'm hoping that they will land on the branches on the side so I, I can get that much more clean actually have a bramblings a couple that's really cool really cool I went down and put out a little stump with the moss and hopefully the problem will land on that that would be perfect so yeah just uh, need to wait now I just turn the camera around in portrait mode so I get a hold of that little uh, stick 
with the moss. I think it has a lot of great character. So I want to show a lot and have a little bird on top. And what bird I am hoping for is the robin. That would be so nice with that gray and red together with the moss. Oh, that would be great. I can't hear it in the area. So now it's just a waiting game. The robin is here. The robin is here. Even though it lands on any branches at all, I don't want to like point and shoot. I just want to focus on that uh, stick there, and hopefully it will land. And then press the trigger. It's good just to have the, uh, the eye on the viewfinder all the time. Just sit there and wait. And when the bird lands, it can could be a, just a split second. But if you have to move your eye here, from here down to the viewfinder, and your hands won't be, will be ready, the bird might be gone. But if you... It's back, it's back. miss it's shot it was just sitting there a split second but that's it's too uh, too late so when I see the bird in the area I meet used to be ready at all time just standing by the viewfinder and then press the trigger as soon as it lands and hopefully one of them is sharp this is good this is really good I really like photographing small birds. It's starting to getting really cold now. <laughs> I should have brought my gloves, but I think I got some uh, oh, good pictures of the blue tit and the robin, so I'm happy. And uh, yeah, let's call this a day and say this is day one of my project. And uh, I have many thoughts. I'm going to share with you later on so if you just uh, press subscribe and that bell button and you will get a notification every time I upload a new video and you don't miss my next episode uh, trying out this hide hair hopefully one day the goldfinch will come that will be perfect yeah but uh, until next time I will see you bye